This lecture includes important MCQs on accounts of joint stock companies. Question number one. Joint stock company is formed under A. Finance Society Act 1913. B. Partnership Act 1932. C. Companies Ordinance 1984. D. Common Carrier Act 1865. The correct answer is C. Companies Ordinance 1984. Question number two. The official signature of the company. A. Partnership deed. B. Common seal. C. Common act. D. None of these. The correct answer is B. Common seal. Question number three. Which business has the perpetual existence? A. Sole proprietorship. B. Partnership. C and B. D. Joint stock company. The correct answer is D. Joint stock company. Question number four. The company which can be formed by at least two members. A. Private company. B. Public company. C. Sole proprietorship. D. All of the above. The correct answer is A. Private company. Question number five. A company is managed by A. Shareholders. B. Managers. C. Directors. D. Employees. The correct answer is C. Directors. Question number six. How many legal basic documents of a public company are? A. 2. B. 3. C. 4. D. 5. The correct answer is B. 3. Question number 7. It contains the rules and regulations for the internal management of company. A. Article of Association. B. Partnership Deed. C. Memorandum of Association. D. Prospectus. The correct answer is A. Article of Association. Question number 8. Formation of a public limited company is based on A. Promotion. B. Incorporation, C. Commencement of business. D. All of these. The correct answer is D. All of these. Question number 9. The liability of a member in a company is generally A. Current, B. Contingent, C. Limited, D. Unlimited. The correct answer is C. Limited. Question number 10. One of the unit into which the capital of the company is divided is called A. Debenture. B. Share. C. Capital. D. Prize bond. The correct answer is B. Share. If you like a video then please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for regular updates.